welcome to the channel. For those of you that are new, welcome to Birth and Bosses with Felicia. And those that have been rocking with me for a while, welcome back to the channel, guys. Hey, 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 happy Monday to each and every one of you. I hope you're having a great day. I'm having a good day so far, guys. Listen, I wanted to take a moment to um, show you guys what I'm going to be doing today. Y'all know the shopping fever wants to take over today. But I have declared that today would be a day of designing i'm gonna go out later but i made a promise to myself look get your work order in um your work area in order and then after you've made about 20 or 25 baskets then you can go out and go to the store that you need to go to but guys listen i have to get this um area together i've already started to clear some of the stuff because um the more stuff that's on your table or the more stuff that's in your work area, of course, it starts to slow you down. So I'm getting ready to organize my items, um, get my tape and everything in one little container, my scissors and anything that I'm not working on at the time, I'm going to um, remove it. Now, I, I work on this. I've been working on this table for like the last week or so. But I honestly like working better in my kitchen because I have an island and I have more space and I can work on more than one basket at a time. And then on this table, I can too. Um, but in my kitchen, I'm able to utilize my really, really large table and also the island. But I'm trying to keep everything confined to one space. So we're going to see how it goes. Maybe as it gets a little bit closer, I'm going to have to go back to the kitchen so I can do more and more at one time okay so what i've already done my mom has wrapped these beautiful boxes and she does such an amazing job with wrapping the boxes and then my daughter came back put the hearts on it for me done an amazing job and um she also um stuffed it with newspaper this morning i just came back laid the tissue paper on top so that when i get ready to go to each box it'll already be stuffed and prepared and ready to go guys so i think today I'm going to start working on the house coat. Um, well, y'all call them robes. North Carolina, I call it a house coat, okay? We're going to be working on the robes, guys, today. Um, I think I'm going to be putting them in those boxes. going to be doing a really, really simple, um, really, really simple box with these robes. I'm not going to put a whole lot of extra stuff with it. It pretty much speaks for itself. But, guys, stay tuned and see what we design for today, okay? Okay, y'all, so we got our workstation cleaned and prepared for work for today. I want to show you guys what I have going on. Okay, so yeah, this is what we have going on, you guys. Um, I want to kind of show you how I set up or how I set up today, okay? Um, and I kind of already have in mind, like I said, we're going to work with the house coats today, the robes. <laughs> we're going to work with them today. So I already know with each one of my robes that I'm going to go in with some type of gift set, okay? Being that the robe is already, although we didn't pay expensive price, it's always kind of, it's already kind of like a pricey item, right? So when I do one pricey item, I will try my best not to add two pricey items in the basket. You know what I'm saying? Like, um, I, it just depends. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't because... Um, one of the bathrobe sets I'm working on is going to have one of the really expensive, um, gift sets with it, but you, you guys are kind of see where I'm going with it. I want to keep, um, keep it like this for these ones right here. And then I'll show you later on a different, um, concept that I will do, um, using the larger gift sets. But with these, I'm going to mix like a house robe. And this has the warm and slipper. So, you know, it's kind of like a little combo thing. But although we only paid $2 for that, like I said, it's one of the most um, expensive items that's going to be in the basket. With this right here, we paid $2.99. So, in reality, we paid more for the warming slippers than we even did for the house robe. But, you know, nobody knows that but us, of course. Um, So, we're going to mix those things up. I already have my candy sitting to the side if I should decide to put some in the basket. I have some little flowers if I want to um, add them to it. I have candles. 
I have coffee mugs and I have added a few of my signs on my table. That way it's going to keep me from having to get up every time, you know, because it can get tiresome too. So all the items that I think I may possibly use is going to be on this table. If I need to get up later and pick up something else out of my inventory room, then I can do that. I got all my supplies right here, my scissors, my tape, um, my Chanel stems or tinsel stems, whatever you call them, and up under the table. I have some more gift tissue, and then I have pre-made bows in that box, okay? Right here, I have my trash can sitting beside me, and um, always keep a trash can nearby, y'all, because it would be so much stuff when you're cutting away at items and stuff, and sometimes I just lay it on the table, and it gets really, really messy. Um, I keep the trash can, or either I will hang a um, bag right here on my ring light, and that really works better for me because when i'm recording my hands i don't have to reach down to the trash can my hands can go right there but anyway this is what it is for today and y'all stick around i'm going to show you the first one that i'm going to put together all right y'all